All right, so now we're gonna do a quick demonstration of the Zoom Rooms uh, kiosk and, and, and workspace reservation and some other cool things. So Erica, take it away. So right now we're utilizing an X30 uh, to show the Zoom kiosk mode. So right now, really quickly, just so you can utilize digital signage as well through Zoom. But say I walked in for the day, maybe our receptionist is out, I can give a virtual receptionist a call here and I'll actually directly call them. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and then once, if I don't need to talk to a receptionist, maybe I already know the space, I don't have any questions, I can actually go to the workspace here. We've uploaded a blueprint of our office and it shows what rooms are available for today. So it looks like uh, the office is pretty open so far. So all I need is, is a small hoteling space. So I'll click the, uh, desk one. Say I only need it till 12. Let's go ahead and reserve this. And now a QR code will pop up. Using your camera or the scan QR option within your Zoom application, I'm going to scan here. You can see we get that green check mark. I'm gonna reserve this space and reservation successful. So now as you look over here, it automatically reserved this space for me. And because of the account, I'm under NYC Olivia. It lets us know when Olivia has this room booked to. So as Olivia, I'm ready to check into my room. Again, I'm going to go ahead and scan that QR code here, ready to check in. And it's going to check in as my own personal Zoom room. So all of my meetings that are on my user account, all of my contacts, all my voicemails are actually going to show up here on my CCX 600 phone. So I have my meeting for today. Again, I know that there's one at 6 p.m. I have my contacts. Again, I, everything is in this, per, this device as my own personal space. When I'm ready to check out, I can check out of the space here. And then the next person who reserved the room can come in and check in with their own personal device. Nice.